This is a highlights video of the dual thrust flight experiments. For a full explanation and details of the static tests, please click here or in the description below. On the first launch, we pressurized the rocket to 120 psi and used a 5 mm internal nozzle. On, go! This is the third launch of the day, this time with a 3mm internal nozzle. That's less than 2% of the cross-section area of the main nozzle. Here you can easily see the two thrust phases. Here you can see the narrow water column during the sustained phase and you can hear the air pulse right around Apogee. This is a comparison flight with a normal 9mm nozzle and launched at the same pressure. It went almost twice as high. As you can see with this dual thrust test that not all experiments lead to better performance, but there are always new things to learn. We were able to create two distinct phases with no moving parts and the rocket was stable in flight. The lower altitudes were actually predicted by the simulations and the blow through effect dropped the efficiency even further.